ZNU-PF spokesperson commits political suicide by blaming Ngwagwa for son's arrest. Former Foreign Affairs Minister Walter Mzembai has strongly criticized ZNU-PF spokesperson Chris Matsvengwa for publicly accusing President Emerson Ngwagwa of authorizing the arrest of Matsvengwa's son. Neville. According to Mzembai, no one expects the ZNU-PF spokesman to commit political suicide by finger-pointing his boss, President Ngwagwa, in this manner. Mzembai, who says he speaks from the perspective of a victim and former minister, asserts that no political or high-profile arrests in Zimbabwe happen unless authorized by the president. Mzembai explains that this has been the case from the Mugabe era to Ngwagwa's presidency. He states that a vice president, unless acting president, cannot authorize the arrest of anyone without consulting the president. Furthermore, Mzembai notes that the president will also never admit that he plays this nefarious role in public, to his direct or indirect victims, nor to inquiring relatives or the public. The standard response, he says, is always, Hendesini, Hendesvazivi, it's not me, I don't know. Mzembai suggests that Mats Vengwa and his wife, Monica, who once held two cabinet portfolios simultaneously, should be accustomed to this tradition and modus operandi by now. He concludes that there is no third force more powerful than the only force to authorize arrests in Zimbabwe and that force is an enigma.